citizens of the internet, I present an open message to each and every one of you. Y'all should know me by now, but if you don't, I am Christian Weston Chandler, the original creator of Sainchu, the Electric Hedgehog Pokemon, back on March 17th, 2000. Any dates earlier are void. I present this open message because I have a whole bunch of people on the internet give me hate. Show me a lot of hate. And I do not appreciate it. it. Takes me off. You think you could just hate me just to get a laugh out of yourself? Think about it. You're laughing at somebody else's pain and torture because I am lonesome, still trying to find a boyfriend free girl and to make it to a sweetheart. Y'all think I'm just a sap, a chump, dumbass, whatever you may think. But you know what? You. You. Every last one of you who has expressed hate against me, you're the shitheads. Also, every last one of you who thinks that I am similar to that of that senile old man and family guy, you're the pedophiles. Every one of you who thinks I'm homo and calls me that because I am not, I'm straight. I'm straight. You're the homos. Every last one of you. I could, I could take the whole time to express so much anger and frustration. I'm only on your side. I do wear glasses. Take it or leave it, losers. It helps me see better. See more detail and more clear vision than any of you knuckleheads can put together out of your own ego that you so richly consume of. But, on a more serious note, learning recently of the false or real literature with downloaded copies of my comic pages and whatnot. It has been either distributed or created without my consent or approval. So it is a fake. And if it ever is published or if it ever shows profit, let it weigh on your consciousness throughout your eternal life that you are torturing and worse off tearing the heart and soul and emotions of the innocent man the, the innocent still 26 year old virgin not only that but I have so many lonely nights and stress that you cannot just imagine it now as for the other serious notes of any new stuff officially made by me under my own hands not by anybody else's which are considered false I just have not been feeling the inspiration to draw to color because the loneliness I cannot stand that the hatred I'm getting from every last one of you who has contributed to that Encyclopedia Dramatica webpage and every other forum, internet document, lewdly drawn pictures with dicks. I love dykes. Dykes. China. I'm straight. If I ever, if I see a dick, I just look away with a moment of being freaked out. And emailing me pictures is not going to get any of you any further conclusion to will Crystal get out of the mirror? Will the seven science you balls be collected? Will I ever find my sweetheart? And am I, am I or Megan Shore still an iron? Which by the way she broke up with me so much long time so much long ago because the contributors to that ED page, you broke the emotional stri strength between us. You promoted such twists and turns to everything I have said and drawn and written and whatnot. 
you broke up the best friendship, the best relationship, the closest I could ever have in this pitiful adult life. You did it! Every last one of you! If I could blame myself, I would definitely blame myself for drawing those five pictures. Those five drawings! And by the way, that is not Crystal whose eyes are censored, that is Megan! And just for, and just for, for taking it up and c twisting it around as such. Think about it. Think about it! Lay on your conscience. Because nothing, no more official science you art or work may or may not ever emerge depending on the amount of hate that is decreased. That web page taken off the internet. I wish I had never found that piece of shit in the first place back on that Halloween of 07, somewhere around there. And promoting the hatred. And drawing such loose, such lucrative mockeries is not going to further the story plot or have anything new created or even going to help in any way. As I am telling you this right into my PlayStation Eye. If I ever do find the one that is to be my sweetheart, I will give her such care, such tenderness, such love. We get around a hanky-panky, that's fine. That's good. We get married. I will have my God created, my God called daughter. She will be taken care of lovingly. Those of you who mock me otherwise with such frivolous, lucrative adultery, if I ever hear another, any more new stuff, it will weigh on your conscience with me tearing at your souls emotionally. Let that weigh on your conscience. For those of you who have already done so or are thinking about doing it, I am not a pedal fork, you dorks! I tell you, so much anger, so much stress, it's hard to see straight. Like that, the result of all that you have contributed against me, weigh heavily like a 10,000 pound anvil. 16 tons, what do you get? Another day older and deeper in debt. If I was not a baptized man over at the Methodist Church by the University of Virginia, I'd tell every last one of you who have contributed to the hatred and downpour, go to hell. But I do but I would not even weigh that upon my worst enemy. Because that, because I am more kind than you think. Y'all just do not see that. Y'all just twist my words around. <clears throat> I do not wish to see any more hatred or adult mockery. And I want that Encyclopedia Dramatica page taken down forever. It will weigh heavily on your conscience each day that it is still up there. leave you with any other thoughts that you may have. But if you dare twist these words around, that will weigh worse on your conscience. The words that I provide from sound mind and heart, it will weigh heavily on you. It will weigh heavily on you.